All right. Let's move these files to this folder. Source folder to destination folder. Now am I I'm going to have a link to the code. It'll be in the YouTube descriptions. So you just have to go like this and copy and then go back to the um, worksheet. <coughs> I'm just going to add a button because when you add a button it always takes you to the correct module. Okay. Then I usually delete this. We can go here and actually assign that button. Okay. Now what happening is this code my source f folder in the code I just have to change the name the folder of the names the names folder so first let's start with the source one okay so we'll go back to the folder source folder just gonna click in here and copy it put it here make sure we have that you keep that backslash there There's that one, and then for this one, the destination folder, destination folder, just going to click in here, copy, and go back to our code, and control V. And right now, I just have a setup, so it's going to move the Excel files, it's not going to move the PDF files. Okay, so I have PDF files, but when it loops through here, it's just going to look for your XLS files or SLSX files. Okay, so I'm just going to go here. Darn, I wish I could give you some more room so you can see what's going on. How about here? I'm going to press F8 to st and we're going to step through the code. So right now, my array only have... Oh, maybe I can put it right in here. There. I only have two different extensions it's going to look for. So first it's going to look, loop through this one and look for any XLSX files. Okay. And since it didn't find one, See, do all my file. It won't find one, so it'll go to add next. Now it's looking for the XLS files, which is, there's a couple of them in there. So I do all that. Source, file, copy. Source file. And then the destination file. Now watch what happens here. This is going to end up here, and then this will get deleted. See, copied. Source 2. Source 2. Loop. Do all. Next. And now the code is over. So you see those files are now here and they're all gone from here. So I'm just going to move them back down there again. Okay. And this time I'm just going to I'm not going to step through the code. We're just going to run it really fast. Boom. See? Bang, bang, gone. Okay. That's how you do it. Just, so just grab my code change the destination folders, change the array of ex file extensions you want to look for, and let it rip. Thanks for watching.